right, here we go again. The wide open prairies of western Texas. Pronghorn antelope hunting in America, baby. You can't do this in France. Let's get settled. The patience game begins. We go from rock and roll insanity. <laughs> spirit cruising baby spirit cruising baby I tried to catch the antelope I ran after him I ran after him just couldn't catch him so I'll wait for him at a water hole perfect There's antelope in all four directions right now. Unbelievable. And blue quail everywhere, jackrabbits, cottontails, another small band of pronghorn, maybe a half a mile here, and a bunch feeding this way behind this water tank. This could be it. The first morning out, this could be it. Antelope, Antelope, Antelope. The beast has landed. Jenny, give me. Did you see that? <laughs> oh, I don't even know where to begin. I got a beautiful mossy oak double bulb line here on a great piece of Texas wild western desert ground near Marfa with Deer Texas. Scott, thank you. Scott Thrash and his Deer Texas outfit put together. I'm looking at antelope, still confused. Stay tuned for more Spirit of the Wild. We're going to go get that magnificent buck antelope. We'll be right back. Welcome back. Here we are. The Spirit is Wild. I made a great shot on a walking antelope about 35 yards. I drilled him from a double bull mossy oak blind with a lightweight bow with a stinger broadhead. The gold tip zebra arrow was so pretty it was insane. The luminoc lit up. I dropped him in his tracks. We don't even have to trail him. Let's go get that buck. With Scott Thrash and DeerTexas.com. What did you do? Sorry it took me so long. I saw the whole thing. Sorry about the tracking, you know, all that tracking we had to do. That was is that great. awesome, man? I watched the whole thing. It's like I had a ringside seat. You got an antelope heaven here. Now, I got to tell you, it's great if I just did this by myself. I'd be so happy, and I would know that wildlife management works. But in this culture war where there are maniacs, there are sick, sick, mentally ill people who would stop this from happening. Now it's important we share it with the world. 60 million antelope almost wiped out because people didn't manage them. Now they're thriving. There's as many antelope, quite honestly, as wild ground can support in North America. Right. There's no room for more antelope. You have to harvest the surplus. How did you find, with DeerTexas.com, booking and guiding hunts, how did you find an antelope heaven where, most importantly, the animals are not pressured, it's selective harvest, it's limited tags based on renewability, habitat, population dynamics, duh. But how did you find this mecca? And what's the ranch, actual ranch name? This is the McGuire Ranch. The McGuire Ranch in Marfa. Say it. Marfa. One time I saw a guy really drunk and he went, Marfa. And I knew I had to go there someday. 
but it's the McGuire Ranch. McGuire Ranch. And, and to he, answer your question, it's just who you know. Uh, it's about hunting buddies getting together, finding out great places, and making sure it's set up right. Great accommodations, little pipes with faucets on it with hot water coming out of them, <laughs> a roof that keeps everything away, cooking. He's the greatest cook, and he washes dith- dishes as good as my mother. You got a great operation. Thank man. you, sir. DeerTexas.com, if you want a quality experience, here's a guy that lives to hunt and hunts to live, and if you share his camp, it's like hunt with your dad, hunt with your brother, hunt with your blood brother. I got to tell you, man, I, I have a feeling that Craig's getting action. We've been out, this is our first morning. Look in my eyes, look, look. With a little bit of sleep, I almost would be handsome, but I'm bleary-eyed. I just finished a hundred plus concerts, and I went from <laughs> to Ah, uh, now I'm in the land of, ah, uh, I feel so <laughs> Texas-like. <laughs> I feel slow and relaxed. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. I couldn't be more proud. God bless you and your family. God bless the American dream, and God bless the U.S. military for making sure we can have an American dream. God bless the warriors. I'll see you here next time, where the spirit is guaranteed to go wild. <laughs> Fighter like that. Beautiful prawns.